again, I start off another episode stuck in the back of a car. Except this time I don't think I'm being kidnapped. Where am I? So this episode is going to be about how to manage your personal wine cellar in respect to your significant other without getting into trouble. So as I said, tonight's episode is all about how to manage our wine collection with our members of our family or perhaps our significant others. And whenever somebody asks me to come to their house and help them set up their collection, one of the first things I do is I pull out every bottle of wine they own and I evaluate them. And then I use a three-tier system. And I call this the green, the yellow, and the red. So to explain this to you, we've come up with a few different scenarios. This is what we call the green. Hey, honey, what are you doing? I'm putting these green dots on these bottles of wine. What does that mean? Well, that means that you can open any one you want. Anyone? Anytime you want. Anytime? With anyone you want to. With anyone? Mm -hmm. Oh, dishwasher. <laughs> Girls night? So, as you can see there, everyone's happy. This process makes everyone happy as heck. But sometimes things escalate a little bit. And that's when we go ahead and go to the yellow. The yellow. Amarillo. Hi, honey. I'm here at the house with Ashlyn, Deborah, and Wendy, and we're wanting to try some of that delicious Chilean wine that you have. It's a yellow dot, so I wanted to call you first. Uh-huh. Yep. And uh, it would be all right if we gave it a shot. Oh, thanks, sweetie. Love you. Bye-bye. <laughs> all right, the yellow. That was exciting. Does it make sense to you now? Now, finally, we go on to what we call the red. And you need to pay attention to this one very carefully. Because if you do this wrong, it can go very wrong. Get away from me. I'm very confused. I just want to go to my room and drink this wine. Drink this wine? You've had your entire life to drink this wine. Get away from me. Wendy, darling, I of my life. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just get away from me! Give it up! You didn't let me finish my sentence. Just get, get away from me! And I'll use it to bash the freaking market. <laughs> but if you do this right, it will enhance you your right. relationship for the rest of your life. Your relationship for the rest of your life, darling. There is slight of my life. I just want you to understand that when I put a red dot on a bottle, it doesn't mean that it's exclusionary. It means it's something that I thought is so wonderful that we should share together. So just remember when you open a bottle of the red dot that I'm at least in the house. Okay, honey. Okay. 